Hello, I'm Melissa Melton of the Rural Community Assistance Partnership. In this segment, we're going to be discussing static mixers or flash chambers, the process of coagulation and flocculation. Static mixers or flash chambers are used for mixing pretreatment chemicals. When the pretreatment chemicals are added, they should be thoroughly mixed with the raw water. Proper mixing of the chemicals can speed the process and even reduce the amount of chemicals used and in the long run, save money. When the raw water and chemicals are mixed, the coagulation process begins. Coagulation chemicals cause organic and other particles to combine. When particles combine, they are more easily removed from the treated water because they become heavier and sink or settle to the bottom of the tank or basin. This action allows the cleaner water on the surface to move on to the next step in the treatment plant. When the coagulant is added, the smaller dirt particles stick together and form bigger particles. This is simply called the flock. In the flocculation process, water flows into a tank or tanks with paddles that provide a slow mixing of the coagulant chemicals. This brings small particles together to form larger particles or clumps. If the mixing is too fast, the flocks will break apart into smaller particles that are very difficult to remove by settling or filtering. The flocculation process can start as water leaves the flash mix chamber or tank and typically moves into a series of two or more very slow moving paddle mixers. The second paddle is sometimes slower than the first. The paddle mixers can be similar to the flash mix, but at a much slower rate. A gradual stealing or calming of the water helps the flock form and keeps it from breaking apart.